Matamsi ya kuja kuambie. Oh, Kingsley, mm. Ebu, I have this bag for me. I, I just I, I go access the, 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 rest, the rest of this. Mm. Five minutes. Niaje? Hii bag ni nani? Ndani. Eh, but let me explain. Ati fulani aliniachia. Pure box kwa. Eh, shape line kwa. I ate, I ate from a no proper seafood. Bana. Mimi nimezoea githeri hapo hivi na matamu za gizo rai. Eh, lens Buddha, lens Buddha. Eh. So you want to travel, you want to travel out of Kenya, umechoka na kukatu malipa moja, you want to go abroad, either overseas or over lake, you name it, we decide. How are you going to keep yourself safe while you're traveling through the airport until, you know, your destination and until you accomplish whatever mission has taken you outside Kenya or wherever you are. So today's topic is a topic that many people can resonate with. We want to keep it simple so that you're able to understand it. And the topic is, you know, travel, safety, and security. And to help me digest this topic is none other than my good friend, Vini Mambo. overseas. <laughs> so when somebody wants to go out of Kenya, Um yeah, I'm Gambi, Vincent. He's my mm. good friend. Um, so normally, I'm usually very uh, casual on, on, on traveling. Mm. Uh, first of all, let's say let's use a country like Uganda. Mm. You want to go to Uganda? Upon your over over lake. Over lake. Yeah. Um, first of all, you have to do the basic research. Okay. Either to type Google, I'm going to let's say Kampala or mm. whatever city. Mm. You just research. Mm. First of all, your place of stay. Okay. Um, means of transport, mm -hmm. of course, also food. Yeah, those basic things. Yeah. Mm. So, when you talk Nairobi, you're you're at, at the airport. Uh -huh. First things first. Um, I know my, I'm speaking from my own experience. Mm. Um, if you're at airport, of course, you may check in. You may your passports, everything. Yeah. Now, that is the most. Now that's where 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 the 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 puzzle begins because in a kwanga very lonely. Ukisha pata yana passport. Ukisha pia na hivi ukienge airport. Yeah. Una kwanga very lonely. Now that's where you start having um. Do you imagine kwa airport? Mm. Si atuta nuko salimia kilamse. Awezi. Yeah. Wena ba giza kum mizigo una una tembe na zo. Yeah. Una check in then you go to the lobby. Mm. Now most often the note una patanga kuna wale sio na fanya ma 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 shady business palendani. Ndani ya airport ndani ya airport na pata msia kuja kuambie oh Kingsley mm. ebu I have this bag for me I, I just I go access the the the, rest, the restrooms yeah. but because you are so kind and very naive utasema <laughs> ah sawa tu si bag tu acha acha dishike lakini mse amekupatia yeye anajua maybe akona contraband ndani hiyo bag ndani hiyo bag oh juu unapata ndani ka bag kadogo tu kapot yeah. maybe kuna matembe Kumbe ah, amemulikwa amejua yeah, amemulikwa sasa ndaka ama ame yani ana yeah. anajua kwa anatafu anafuatwa anakuja kuambia ah chika bado nikimbie yo so naive ujui we na mta waenda 5 minutes ni aje hii bag ni nani ndani mm. eh but let me explain ati fulani aliniachia acha box kwa eh acha pelen kwa so kama mtu anataka ku travel mtu anatoka especially ndani ya airport unajua watu mm. wajuangi ya kwamba mm there is some semblance of detention yes eh, in every yani wanakunyima some sort of freedom exactly. inside there so it, it's it's like you're detained in a way it's a confined space yeah mark you yeah. um assuming you're on transit mm. um you're going to let's say um you're going to like australia mm. you probably go to dubai mm. then from dubai you go to perth or canberra in dubs you just we talk in there you first of all una visa ndani ya airport unataka kwa airport uwezi uh -huh. toka uwezi toka hata uwezi eh uwezi ataka nyanga nje tutashikwa wana ku detain ndani ya airport eh so your airport it's a very confined space it's huge you know what mm, yeah yeah nasikia hata kuna kwa na electric cars eh yeah. siku huko ndani but yeah. shida in terms of your mental space mm. for your like because you're so keen on your security mm. you don't go say night to everyone 
Yeah. You don't carry people. One year mm. ata kulala. Mm. Bro, unalala na wasiwasi. Like okay. my last trip, me mm. I went uh, last last my last travel, mm. I was in loops for nine hours. My, my layover, flight, yeah. yeah, waiting for my next flight. Uh-huh. And you know, we ato kido, you know, like tuzako, hivi. Yani, na akuna bed. Akuna bed. Yeah. Unless asa kuna zile hoteli, zime kupat, zile, zine, zile airlines wako na wana kubo, yeah, wana yeah. check-in kwa hoteli. Yeah, yeah. Basa sisi ni raia tu. Iyo do bad, adu jafika bed. So tuambie, mm. umetoka, yes, kuna visa. Tutumie tu Dubai sasa. Mm. Umetoka Dubai, ama tutumie tu Europe, mm. anywhere. So ume ingia kwa airport umemalizana nayo detention yako nini umepatiana visa yako umetoka umeingia sasa kwa streets mmm yeah. so best yangu aliniambia mai gongwa pesa mimi nilifikiri hizo vitu ni vitu za eh kumbe so, ni all over eh yeah, wajanja wako wengi yeah. so uh, kwanza uh, i mentioned earlier about research eh? yeah. kwanza unaangalia the, the currencies mm. i normally I, I normally change before I travel, before I, I, I get into the flight. Mm. For instance, like I, I'm in Nairobi, mm. I'll try my level best ni, ni change my currencies here. Oh, kiwa nyumbani bado. Eh, kiwa okay. uh-huh. Let's say I get dollars. Mm. So, ni fast forward, nisha, nisha land, mm. ni meshuka. Now, a lot of people don't know, oh. as you exchange your dough, yeah. wengi ni matapili. Wana kugonga live ukiwa. Matapili. Mm. Utapata ni umempe MC umempatia 100 a dollar bill. Mm. Yeah, me sinona sinona ngabile counters na kuanga. Kuna quick hands yani. Eh, yeah, umempatia ameku amekuchanganisha, mm. amekupe fake. Uh-huh. Anakuwa anashtuka, anajifanya wewe we ni fake bana. You give me a fake currency. Sasa mtu inafaa fanya aje hapo. So me normally what I do eh I, I take a, f- a shots of my currencies. Sinajui kuna zero number. Mm. I take a picture na jikia. Na ika simu. Sasa ukiwa pale kwa Habibu uh, ningia hapo sasa say, mm, like okay. if today i know let's say nime 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 nataku nataku maybe ku change money around let's say 5 mm. that after place nitaenda kama kwa room ni pigi zile currency nataku change okay. like i love all the serial numbers eh mm. alafu ndio niende that also i do when you get into taxis sana sana wazee wa taxi wakiona dola mtu wangu ndio hivyo oi damu ninachemka eh? ukora Mtu wani umempe dola hivi? But sasa vini, mm. si ni heri upigia wakati upenye umefika. Kama ni taxi, pigia hapo kwa taxi. Ya yeah, uneze pigia hapo. Yeah. But, but tena ni... utatrakt wa seku wako. Eh, hey, pia sana ukipigia hapo, pia lazima ukwe pia very careful. Usipigia lafu watu waza kushanga umse ni anafanya. Hey. So normally, upigia like, let's say like 10 minutes before you change. Ah, nice. Let's say if you are walking, just take a bill, mm. take a shot, ingia kwa, kwa forex. So hapo, hapo na mpe, yeah. Apo unampe hiyo bill, laki kugeuzi ya unamuambia, abu let me read the serial ya hiyo bill menpe. Na unamuambia, unarezonate with your photo. Unamuambia, I took mm. this, fo- this picture 10 minutes ago when I was coming. And this number, and what you are telling me is, I, I, as you align. So, hapo atajua ni janjesa. Hapo atajua ni mjanja. Now, the other, the other trick also, eh? you go exchange money, unasikia. You see, they usually have a tabulation. Yeah, yeah. yeah One Currency, dollar, let's yeah. say. Yeah. Change, exchange rate. Exchange rate, yeah. yeah. That's the word. Unangia mali, unapata mtu na kuambia, tunatumia exchange rate ya central bank ya hiyo country yao. Uh-huh. So ya yeah, 40 ya 40 ya 40 ni ina yeah. ina displayed. Yeah. Basa sasa jojo huwezi jua, huwezi jua the jo hujaishi huko so. Eh, so mm. hata utamwambia, kumbe sasa hiyo amebadilisha hizo rates. Amerithi uh-huh. sasa value ya pesa yako. Mm. Akikwambia hiyo ndio rate una change nayo kwa kwa central bank. Oh. So unamwambia ukiambiwa hivyo unamwambia okay fine, let me just check the rate on it. Actually, I'm going to go online. I'm going to go online. Let's use this one. You know what? So, I'm work with, um, uh, let's say, money that could change pesa. Yeah. 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 And then, kuna rate that's going to go up. Yeah. But here, I'm saying, I'm going to go up. Exactly. I'm going to go up. I'm going to go up. Yeah. So, so, and because, of course, you, talk, you're not, you, you don't know the mm. rates. So, most of a lot of people are gullible. I'm saying, okay, let's change then using those central bank rates. So okay. after all, bro, shoo. By the time you talk, you realize, ay, na hido yu meku haji kidogo. Ukirudi, hata lama mwenye liko kwa kaunta, hame enda kuko nyuma, mungiri hame kuja. Utashitaki nani? Ako, utaduni. Watapeli ba. Wakora. Mina kumbuka, uh, my first time kupanda ndege. Culture shock kwanza. Mm. Tumetoka, iliko waniki wafo mtu. So tumenda kucheza junior team, rugby. Mm. So tumeenda... Definitely because mko under age ampewi kutumia pesa. Yeah. 
but um, at the end of it all kuna venye ukona yako tu umejipanga in a way ya kwenda ku change mm. so sisi hao tumeenda tukoenda tu the same same actually tulikoenda Morocco so tuka lay over dubs kidogo alafu ndio mm. Morocco so tumeenda pale kuna mse wakati saa tusha tusha land uh, dubs mm. mse amekuja hapo hivyo ni kama ana ana change tu pesa hey. not in the airport i think kulikuwa na game bado dubs na mm. na Morocco so tumetoka nje ya dubs tushaonyeshwa hoteli tumelala so tumeenda kwa market kuna market tu yeah. pale dubs penye wasi wana changingi ni kitambo hii ni ma... nikiambia watu watajua miaka yangu <laughs> but ni kio form tu so yeah. wameenda wamechange wamechange hiyo do kumbe dira menye unapewa tena mm. kidogo sio hiyo rate a rate wamekizaa wamekugonga rate, rate. uko ku, kuchezwa dola labda ni but rates watakuchezea kama wewe si mse yeah. so hiyo hiyo point umesema ya ku verify kwa online yeah. inakusaidia. Yeah, you just make sure you just tweet. Or normally ama mm. if you maybe don't have of course kuna the challenge of having the networks yeah. and sim cards. So, kuna roaming ama yeah, you can <laughs> eh, roaming pia ni do. But <laughs> normally ukiwa kwa hotel of course kuna wifi so you just screenshot yeah. the rates variants. Use na bana unaweza angalia after one hour unaangalia mm. rate ni change. So you have an average you have at least have a thought of uh, e range in a range from you know the number of place do may change utashanga ai you know but then you realize ulitoka huko ulichezwa yeah na wakati most airports no nanga like kuna the small airports na kuna zile kubwa kama sasa ya dubs yeah. when people move inside there mm. you know what should they look up for ni nini inafaa wako ya awake in, apart from umetuambia mambo ya kubebea watu mzigo wenye si yao eh yeah. yeah. ni nini nyingine mtu inafaa kuwe careful within the airport kabla atoke um i think first you um ujue where you are your entrance people say ya kuingia ndege the gates they Gate. called the gate one to tapata gate yeah. one c yeah. at least you do at least you try to find out iko wapi mm you try to find out the timing of your of your of your of your check in ndege kwa yeah. sababu i've seen atami ya fall prey of it mm. like mm. una assume una ndege yako ni let's say 10 mm. na sasa unaangalia unaona ni ni 7 so you say you have like 4 hours yes so normally i go first check where my gate is i verify my flight ticket numbers uh-huh. then na jua ni ile gate so before at your time before, before at okay. so then i can do whatever i'm doing mm. but sasa a lot of people wait they do the opposite they wanangoja paka time yeah alafu unaangalia ah my flight 30 minutes you know at that time na sasa kondo confusion ina come mm-hmm. hapo utapata umechanganishwa utapewa bagi ya mtu ama ujipata umebeba bagi ya mtu mm. ama ujipata umeenda kwa lobby ya yenye ndege si ya nyu ile ile umeenda kuketi kwa gate mm. unaangalia ai gate yangu ni saa ngapi unaona hii gate iko cancel ama imechangiwa yeah. let them realize so um no no your your your, your timings mm. gates zako penye utaenda Mm. Alafu pia kuna hawa si hawa airport attendants. Mm. Establish ni akina wa gani? Cuz wase ni wengi kuna cleaners, kuna of course the, the passengers. So, so staff staff wenye na work hapo kwa airport. Yeah, you, you find mm. kama let's say your Emirates when you want to Emirates nataka ina ina hii. Mm. You establish also the medical centers. Also, Within the, yeah, the airport yeah, Ziko. All, yeah, this uh, mm. all the airports have um, medical centers. Mm. So you establish uh, Uh, what do you call it um, mm. those centers of course you buy what you need kuna wasi upata nozi wa kupanda ndege so you the pharmacies chemists rather you okay. go buy mm. yeah and you're good so you to mwongea juu ya mtu mwenye kwa airport mm. so umesikia wakati kwa airport make sure umejua geti yako ni gani mm. eh, usifanye vitu ina rush yeah. usikubali kubeba bag uh, umepewa bag na stranger labda imebeba contraband na labda mtu alikuwa anafuatwa mm tumeongea about um, knowing where and how to change your currencies yes. if possible change currency yako before when, before you travel ndio mm. sasa tushafika tusha change currency yetu tumekaa sasa tumefika sasa mahali penye tuseme sasa tutumie europe sasa mm. kwa europe tumefika tushaonyeshwa hoteli penye ntalala ni hapa mm. how do you move in town and this is a new place now um ku move I normally do um uh, what do you call it um uh, a sweep mm. I establish the tax the taxes especially this with this technology mm. you know I get a 
mm. Uber you download the application okay. and you in those countries. You just ask. Uber ya Kenya bado ina work to. Yeah, Uber Uber it works everywhere. Okay. Only if it has been authorized to to work because okay. there are some countries they have their own Uber kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like uh, taxi hailing uh, uh, exactly. Yeah. So you get to the hotel mm. unauliza which app do you people use for movement wana ku download ya muna download number okay. 2 um unaangalia sasa kama bike sio kuna kama sasa kuko home mm. kuna do this uh. kuna tuk tuks kuna mm. these mini buses kuna the metro the trains uh -huh. so un establish come of course in a short distance that's a, a walking distance you can yeah. walk now but you need to be very careful mm -hmm. because of the streets so you are in a kilam tai kona kona back six down na machoche so you just ask of course now with technology google mm. it gives you the directions yeah. of course so you can ask people mm. um sana sana wale wasi wasi si kilam buta uliza kwa streets kuna wale wasi watakam watakudanganya utakwambia kama a walking distance ya like 2 kilometers watakupatia direction utatembea kama 8 kilometers wao kuzungusha na labda ndio wakupore ama wakupore eh wanaweza kutamta wakwambia pitia pale kumbe watu wake wanakupeana so ah. you ask the same mm. direction from two mm. different people to verify to verify mm. so yeah, yeah so kuna hiyo pia mm. time inza kutembea okay like uh, as a time I was in Istanbul Turkey mm. Mm. um Turkey is a tourist that city is a tourist city yeah however kuna ukora mob sana mm. I remember we were at uh, Intercon. Mm. Intercon iko iko uko down downtown. Mm -hmm. But as a kwa streets. Yes. Mnaambo ikifika 6 if you are a foreigner be careful. Oh, wenye wenye nchi sasa. Eh, sasa wajanja wa wenyewe wana wana run streets. Na kweli utaona tu. Okay. You see some some guys wanatembea na maybe broken bottles, sometimes at a dagger. Mm. Eh, so you you are the, you are the prey. So you need to be very careful. Na kama uta, you walk, don't walk alone. You have walk, somebody yeah, you have walk either in twos or threes mm. or have someone wako mwenye anaweza anaweza kukuonesha. Kuna kitu umemention na naona ni very important. Like una travel unaenda place sasa ushafika. Yeah. The food. Mimi napenda food sana. Mm. The kind of food that is uh, served huko. Yeah. Inafaa mtu akuwe very careful because um, sometimes unakuta you go and uh, labda mmeenda kama team mm. yeah mmeenda mm. kama kikundi mmefika mm. mm. pale you start ordering for food simply because uh, your friend ameulizia hiyo yeah, so wewe yeah, unataka yeah, yeah, yeah. bila kujua kwamba labda you know the name yenye unaijua kama uh, uh, kama chips so unaenda unaenda mahali kama states na unataka chips chips as we know it in Kenya <laughs> those <the> chips that <laughs> see, see chips huko utapewa kriba uh, So it's important also to understand the language when it comes to the yeah. food yes. and also the type of food and where to eat. Yenye mm. natrudisha mm. kwa hiyo mambo ya research. Because mm. um culture shock ina inamaliza watu especially when you're traveling for the first time. Yeah. Na culture shock ni ile vitu zenye haujai meet experience yeah. so you become an easy target for anyone yeah. uh, and you become susceptible to a lot of threats zenye zinaweza kuwa pale. Mm. Mimi sasa umefika umetulia watu wamekuchangia pesa wakora walikuwa wanajaribu kukupora <laughs> wameshindwa <laughs> eh umeenda pale na probably you fall ill mm. what can you do before you travel uh, before you travel sasa kini sasa umefika what can you do before you travel so that in case uh, umeenda pale na umekuwa mgonjwa mm. na uko in a foreign country yeah ni nini through experience so, like, like actually my last travel in Gonjeka sana yeah, I ate I ate prawn and octopus seafood bana mimi nimezoea githeri hapo hivi na masamosa za githeri eh lens bud lens buda eh yeah. hey, it's terrible and yeah. you mentioned about food you see the, the the problem that people have ni excitement okay it's not even culture shock the excitement mm. oh you've seen my food is meko shanza eh sasa unataka zile za kwanza za picha za instagram kwa kwanza sasa kwanza na sasa hata ujini unakula mm. so i i normally eat what i'm used to okay like fried food kama mm. kama wa, ma, potatoes mm. fries um mm. rice mm. veggies but hizi machakulo unaanga jina imeandikwa sijui chicken biryani sijui nini jimeko mm. ai 
Oh, tang twister. Hey, Jina ni Sasa utaona mtu akisema ah injo anataka sasa hivi. Bro. Kumbe hiyo ndio inaenda ku ina start engine ya tu. Oh, trunk super hivi utaenda. <laughs> so, uh, I I advise mtu wa kule tu zile tu wamezoea. Yeah. Okay. You can test, mm. but not necessarily eat. Mm. And if you have to eat, you have also to ask the chefs. So kwa hapo tu. Unauliza but they what is this? What is it made for? How do you make it? Atako explain here. Does it have pepper? Does it have chili? Mm. There are some cultures they have chili or pepper in everything. Like the Southeast Asia mm. countries, India, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka. Au hata maji kidogo utapata imeko kwa chili. Iko na pilipili kwa maji. Kitu yoyote. Eh, hey, hawasi ni wakali. Ah, okay. oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so pilipili kila kitu. Literally everything. Mm. Tea, tea has pepper. Mm. Unyo chai, chai. Chai kuna pilipili. Kuna pilipili. Huko sukari ni foreign kwao. Eh? So, una una maji sa uja, uja kwa ina society where you eat. Mina, na, bado na imagine chai ya pilipili. Yeah, ni noma. Na they will drink it. You find a young kido. Ame shikilia thamos, ame kunyomba. Moto na whistle, hey. inateremuka. Ya, yeah, kunyo. So, uh. kwa video excitement, mm. at least unaulizia. Alasa pia kuna hiyo pia pressure. Umona mm. Kingsley ameka migu tatu za kuku pia unataka kuweka. Eh. Zi. And don't eat. Usikule ushibe. Eh. Uwe kula tu utosheke. Kwa zoso pia ujui vile body ta react. Asa mimi siyezi enda uko ni kule kumaliza. Ah, ah. Wewe, wewe, zoso utaumia. Wewe ukule ukaifitu, ukwe tu comfortable. Enough too for me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, you eat at least what you are conversant with. Mm-hmm. Na kama una try new dishes, of course, kuna hizo pia street foods pia. Yeah. Now, the problem with street foods ni hygiene. Hygiene mm-hmm. levels. Okay. Ata kutumutani sinu nanga mdo alichota maji ziwa api na mipika na samosa. Juzi kulikuwa na ile story ya msia. E, ya mtura. Ana, ana wapaka na anaka samosa. <laughs> so, so you can e. imagine. You've seen it. Nitamu, vili chakuleza sisi nitamu. Mm. Lakini ujui the level of hygiene. Yeah. Na ujui vile body ya kuita react. So, usikuwa excited. You excite me. Zizi, eat, just eat what you are used to, like, mm. kenye tu unajua hiyo ina hita na ribikia. Nilikuwa nimeuliza about uh, now, uh, ume fall sick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Is there yeah. a way that mtu waneza, before uende? Uh, uh, kuna uh, sasa insurance cover. Ya yeah, hapa, anachukule insurance hapa? Yes, there are some medical, there are good insurance company where they give you international cover. Okay. Like normally, like now when I was sick, I mm. use, I don't use, I don't want to yeah, yeah. mention the name, but my recover, yeah. 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 the cover I used, it mm. was, it is, in, it was internationally recognized. Okay. But now the problem ni kuklaim. Oh, unalipa lafu na uja? Ati, kwanza, ati, kwanza wa confirm, alafu utibie. So, oh. lazima make sure you have good insurance. Okay. Um, of course, also pia do. Kama ukona do, kama una insurance, mm. of course, have some um, miscellaneous money for in case mm. you get sick yeah, yeah. also pia umefanya u- u- research hizo food za pia when you come show earlier mm. at least do have an idea on the type of foods they eat like mm. in turkey mm. turkey they eat a lot of bread a lot okay. of bread like everything is served with bread so utapata na hiyo 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 kama uko allergic to to to, to what do you call it yeast mm. my dough yeah inaweza kuharibia at least kwa conversant get good insurance and pia kwa na do kwa na float in case so na sema ku travel ni wazito tu si it depend unaweza yeah. patatu hata good package yenye tu itakusaidia si lazima ti kwa na do of course pia na utembe na madawa zako normally um mambo sio bebe painkillers at least mm. have some painkillers have some antibiotics have some sunscreens just in case kuna mtu tutenda um alafu pia have easy dye stops that ile those things are ku 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 stop prevent the yeah. uh, diarrhea mm. and also have um the organism mentioned allergy okay cetrizen those mm. those kind of that ones at least they'll help you in case so yeah. mimi siko nimebeba the last time i got sick it was crazy mm. i'll show you photos after hey, it was mad tar eh hey. engine ilikuwa bro. overkill how is the worst part when you are going to go abroad Wezi piga ti kings li kamu, kamu ni chukue. Hawa sikonza ta muwele, hawa mungi the same language. Talking about language, wana vile mi wambia tu watu ni like kukreate yu rapo na environment yako. Na nambianga watu about just talking to people. And 
abroad sasa umetoka mm. out of Kenya mm. definitely hao watu labda hawaski Kiswahili mm. mtu afanye nini ah uh, unajua mm. same let's say you know they say you go to the rooms you do what the room do yeah? Yeah, yeah so normally same kama nimeenda a country like uh, like let's say china mm. language barrier hiyo uh, wanaongeanga in mathematics they speak mathematics their, their language hiyo hata hakuna letters hapo hiyo eh hiyo ni mao Uh-huh. so at least make an effort to do salamu yao okay how uh-huh. 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 kama ni japan arigato na salimia mm. but sasa shida ya watu kufanyanga ni hiyo kwa ignorant you assume everyone speaks english ah nasema ah, english it's a ni kila mahali mm. language you go to a place mtu hata kizungu aju so at least know those salutations yeah? mm. saying thank you mm. excuse me those basic basics they help you through Okay. Na pia sasa na with technology kuna no translator, Google, Google translator, translator kuna hizi applications at least Duolingo yeah. sasa some other funny funny apps or pale mm. they help you get get along. Tutaweka tutaweka hizo ma, ma apps zikusaidie huko eh, mbele. So mm. at least with that you can ask for help. Unaweza pata madhe umekuwa pressed. Lakini uweze uuliza pale kwa pale kona lakini ujui ujui vile utaambiwa jamaa utatumia sign language zote zitaisha. Wewe tembo malize ulisha mess. Basi at least you uh. just to know kwa at least um ujue tu yani. Mm. Yeah, make a deliberate effort to just know. Basic sasa tembo kwa tunaongea at yote. Mm. But ile excuse me to create attention kanaweza muita kikwa mama mwambia. Pia yeah. kumwambia asante. It will mm. take you through. Wow. Yeah. Hii ni topic yenye yani naona iko very vast ni vitu zenye watu tunajua mm. but tuna assume una assume eh mm. una, unajua tu ukiwa mta utasalimia mtu utamuuliza direction mm. but uh, once umetoka out of pale in my own opinion i think it's also important to understand sheria zao yeah no because mm. watu wengi wana fall victim uh, of uh, circumstances because hawajaelewa which brings us back to ile research nyo nilikuwa nasema mm kuna so, kuta umeenda kwa nchi fulani ambayo hayalao kufanya vitu fulani mm. na wewe umeenda umefanya hizo vitu like if you go to muslim countries na unanga huwezi salimia a lady na yeah, mkono actually culture yeah 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 true huwezi huwezi enda kuwasalimia na mkono yeah. na sasa wewe umeona umeona mtu because you excited and you are african and you love you know greeting, greeting people you end up in in trouble Yeah, kuna actually actually there are people who take offense. Yeah. Actually, you are very right. Um mm. maybe to mention mm. there are people or rather there are cultures you need to know how to 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 say hi, yeah. how to express yourself. Yes, yes. Because now kama kwetu kwetu una samia mother, una mgotea, una mhag. Some countries hata a lady like mm. in India you have to do namaste like oh. yo we do that mm. they not even what are what are utakuchukulia kama ni wao immediately but when ushikilia mtu mkono ama ama mtap zi so lazima at least umefanya research unajua body contact ni haram ama wao they prefer kuna nyo pia watakani kuhagiwa you squeeze ila tu umeguna kaka so hivi unamuliza kidogo so you need to at least to know those things they will help you a lot your safety utakuwa safe but sasa ukinu gotewa alafu ajua sasa if you don't know what ajua Uyu, usiwe usiwa hapa usiwa hapa mm. na hiyo si ime kuexpose yeah 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 hata kwaweza kwa umeenda kufanya shughuli nyingine lakini wameshaona uh, ujamaa vile anafanya vitu zake kweli mm. umse is not conversant with these cultures so at least make an effort we venice tumepiga story sasa mm-hmm. tupe tu yeah. parting shot through your experience vile umeko ki travel what are the things zenye mtu anaweza look forward to ni nini mtu anaweza fanya Um, you know <clears throat> ukiwa tu peke yako like in mm. your research what mm. will you research about vitu kama hizo before we call it a wrap um i normally have the do and the, you search the do's and don'ts mm-hmm. as you've mentioned kuna countries kuna kitu kwetu ni, ni, ni normal mm. like unaona 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 kuvuka road it's yeah. walking yeah. Ile, ile yeah, 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 yeah. there are some streets utafanya hivyo will be fine instant haifai ukimbie kwa barabara Z. Eh? especially in european countries mm. Uta, utajiwalk yes mm. pale ya cross utapata jamaa amekungoja unapewa receipt shika but that's what we normal okay so at least do a research like make effort to catch any jua what to do mm. where to go 
what time to do things. So kwa checklist yako yeah. kuna to do list. Kuna to do list. Okay. And of course then the don'ts. Because mm -hmm. they if you understand what they don't want, it, it your stay will be easy and comfortable. Okay. And know the do's. So just at least make an effort to research. Me normally mwambe mm. say hata kama unaenda town different. At least research. Kidogo to after take a day. Angalia ona end online chick checki ujue mm. ase unapenda nini of of course also kuna the usienda tu pia ukose kujibamba yeah. of, look for the tourist attraction sites look forward to explore the, the different uh, dishes mm. places understand culture mm. na pia kubaya masuv buy to the souvenir yeah. uh. na dress code pia ujue dress code ujue but dress code ina rushanga watu wengi uh, dress code takutoa yeah. timing kabisa mm. wow Nini, this is amazing. It's a topic that uh, tumeichukua kama Crime Shield podcast. Okay. Yenye, you know, only at Crime Shield podcast ni utapata zile topics zenye watu who ignore mm. and yet zina to affect. That makes sense. Good. So thank you so much for coming. You're thank welcome. you for honoring my call. I hope you out there umeelewa Crime Shield podcast fans. I hope umeelewa ya kwamba there are things that you need to do before you travel. There are things you need to do during your travel and the things you need to do even after. Mambiwa mm. after traveling, make sure at least you souvenir. Shitua watu ya kwamba ulitoka. Usi kaya tu alafu usituonyeshe because if you do not record it, then it won't happen. While sure. you're there, understand the culture, understand uh, what is supposed to be done uh, in the airport, understand what kind of luggage you need to carry, what is accepted in the plane, what is not, and many more. Any questions about this topic, any ideas about uh, travel, just put it down there in the comment. We'll try as much as possible to give you more feedback. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe to our channel because that is the only way that can support us to keep on giving you good quality content, mm. impacting you positively through security. Sure. See you next time and keep it Crime Shield.